I'm going to show you how to do a really easy cheesy mushroom. This is something that I will eat as a meal all on its own. So today we're going to use a vegan friendly cheese which melts beautifully, it's full of flavour that's still quite mild so it doesn't take away from the mushroom flavour at all. So what I'm going to do is just take the stalks out of my beautiful flat mushrooms. You want a nice flat mushroom that's going to hold all the goodness that we're going to throw in here. Arrange them however you like. Now I'm going to pop some pesto onto these and that just adds a little flavour punch. This is a pesto I've made just out of basil and pine nuts but you can use a store bought one, whatever suits you. So you want to put a nice generous dollop of that on your mushroom so that every bite you have has a little bit of pesto on it. Next thing I'm going to do is chuck some wilted spinach. So this is something that I put on most things and wilted spinach just adds a really nice chunk of veggie content, also quite a bit of iron and if you've got some spinach in your fridge that's just starting to go a little bit funky, this is exactly where you use it so you're not wasting any food. So that goes on top of the pesto. So the next thing I pop onto the mushroom stack is some Kalamata olives and these are already pitted. This is a way that I add in, again, more veggies into my diet so it just adds up fibre, it's good for you, reduces your cancer risk but also, little sneaky trick, it adds some saltiness. So I'm not going to put any extra salt on the dish, I'm just going to use the olives to do that. So these go on top of the spinach. Look at these coming together and all the colours. Okay, so this goes onto my last mushroom. And the last thing we do is add a little bit of this vegan friendly cheese, which is really easy to work with, really, really beautiful flavour and I find it melts really easily. So it takes this mushroom stack to the next level. You don't need much, but look at that. It grates beautifully and it's got a slightly different texture to cheese that's made out of cow's milk, but it melts so beautifully and I love the creaminess of it. And guess what? That is your mushroom stack done. I'm going to pop that in the oven 180 degrees for about 20 minutes so it all melts down, bit of pepper on top and we're gonna be good to go. Those. They've come out of the oven. The vegan cheese has melted beautifully. I've used Edam cheese here, but you can use whatever you like. There's Gouda, um, there's Better as well, which would go beautifully. I would eat these honestly as a meal all on its own because it's really all you need and they're really quite filling. You can have that as a side dish as well, but that is a huge hit of veggies and seriously delicious.